The free exploring mind of the individual human is the most valuable thing in the world. It is a common experience that a problem difficult at night is resolved in the morning after the committee of sleep has worked on it. If you find yourself in a fair fight, your tactics suck. Ideas are like rabbits. You get a couple and learn how to handle them and pretty soon you have a dozen. Don't worry about losing. If it is right, it happens. The main thing is not to hurry. Nothing good gets away. It's a hard thing to leave any deeply routine life, even if you hate it. If you want to destroy a nation, give it too much. Make it greedy, miserable and sick. If you're in trouble, or hurt, or need, go to the poor people. They're the only ones that'll help, the only ones. And now that you don't have to be perfect, you can be good. When two people meet, each one is changed by the other, so you've got two new people. I suppose our capacity for self-delusion is boundless. Power does not corrupt, fear corrupts. Perhaps the fear of a loss of power. It has always seemed strange to me. The things we admire in men, kindness and generosity, openness, honesty, understanding and feeling are the concomitants of failure in our system. And those traits we detest, sharpness, greed, acquisitiveness, meanness, egotism and self-interest, are the traits of success. And while men admire the quality of the first, they love the produce of the second. You know how advice is, you only want it if it agrees with what you wanted to do anyway. Only mediocrity escapes criticism. I wonder how many people I've looked at all my life and never seen. Books are the best friends you can have. They inform you and entertain you, and they don't talk back. It's almost impossible to read a fine thing without wanting to do a fine thing. I believe that love cannot be bought except with love. Sometimes a lie is told in kindness. I don't believe it ever works kindly. The quick pain of truth can pass away, but the slow eating agony of a lie is never lost. I think everyone in the world to a large or small extent has felt rejection, and with rejection comes anger, and with anger some kind of crime in revenge for the rejection, and with the crime guilt, and there is the story of mankind. To be alive at all is to have scars. I believe a strong woman may be stronger than a man, particularly if she happens to have love in her heart. I guess a loving woman is indestructible. If you understand each other, you will be kind to each other. Perhaps the best conversationalist in the world is the man who helps others to talk. I have come to believe that a great teacher is a great artist and that there are as few as there are any other great artists. Teaching might even be the greatest of the arts since the medium is the human mind and spirit. A sad soul can kill quicker than a germ. A little hope, even hopeless hope, never hurt anybody. Man is the only kind of varmint, sets his own trap, baits it, then steps in it. What good is the warmth of summer without the cold of winter to give it sweetness? 
Nearly everyone has his box of secret pain. It is a time of quiet joy, the sunny morning. When the glittery dew is on the mallow weeds, each leaf holds a jewel which is beautiful if not valuable. This is no time for hurry or for bustle. Thoughts are slow and deep and golden in the morning. All great and precious things are lonely. And finally, in our time, a beard is the one thing that a woman cannot do better than a man, or if she can, her success is assured only in a circus. It's so much darker when a light goes out than it would have been if it had never shone. An answer is invariably the parent of a whole family of new questions. The nicest thing in the world you can do for anybody is let them help you. I know now why confusion in government is not only tolerated but encouraged. I have learned a confused people can make no clear demands. The final weapon is the brain, all else is supplemental. I shall revenge myself in the cruelest way you can imagine. I shall forget it. No man really knows about other human beings. The best he can do is to suppose that they are like himself. I am convinced that basically dogs think humans are nuts. The camera need not be a cold mechanical device. Like the pen, it is as good as the man who uses it. It can be the extension of mind and heart. My own journey started long before I left and was over before I returned. It is the nature of man to rise to greatness if greatness is expected of him. And this I believe, that the free, exploring mind of the individual human is the most valuable thing in the world. And this I would fight for, the freedom of the mind to take any direction it wishes, undirected. And this I must fight against, any idea, religion or government which limits or destroys the individual. This is what I am and what I am about. Sometimes a man wants to be stupid if it lets him do a thing his cleverness forbids. This I must fight against, any idea, religion or government which limits or destroys the individual. Writers are a little below clowns and a little above trained seals. Socialism never took root in America because the poor see themselves not as an exploited proletariat, but as temporarily embarrassed millionaires. I find out of long experience that I admire all nations and hate all governments. An unbelieved truth can hurt a man much more than a lie. It takes great courage to back truth unacceptable to our times. There's a punishment for it, and it's usually crucifixion. I am happy to report that in the war between reality and romance, reality is not the stronger. I have lost all sense of home, having moved about so much. It means to me now only that place where the books are kept. Thoughts are slow and deep and golden in the morning. The redwoods, once seen, leave a mark or create a vision that stays with you always. No one has ever successfully painted or photographed a redwood tree. The feeling they produce is not transferable. From them comes silence and awe. It's not only their unbelievable stature, nor the color which seems to shift and vary under your eyes. No, they are not like any trees we know. They are ambassadors from another time. 
thought-provoking quotes have the power to inspire us? Which quote from the video resonated with you the most? Let me know in the comments below.